are officially in North Macedonia. What's up with it guys? We are headed over to North Macedonia today. We're gonna to check out a city called Struga. It's on Lake Ockrid and we're gonna go there now. We got a guy coming to pick us up. Um, a fan of the show arranged for us to have a ride out there and a couple nights in a hotel. He wants us to document his town. We're gonna to meet some of his contacts, see if we can build some relationships. We're gonna check out North Macedonia and then we're gonna see where the trip takes us. All right, guys, we got a Benz picking us up. The homeboy arranged a ride for us, so this should be pretty interesting. We'll see what North Macedonia is all about. So we made it through Elbasan, um, kind of like an industrial town. Didn't look like there was a whole lot to see, but the surrounding countryside has been beautiful. The road has really been kind of wild, just really, really windy. Um, but you know, after living in Vietnam, it's really not so bad. I actually feel like I could drive out here. I think if we stayed out here and our residency works out, we're probably gonna end up getting our own car. guys so we are nearly at the border of Macedonia it has been a windy but very beautiful trip so far um, the, the scenery is mostly mountainous it's been pretty nice um, we're gonna be coming up to the border soon and I'll do a little clip to let you guys know how it was getting over the border but aside from a little bit, bit of traffic coming through some of the towns it's been pretty smooth um, it's been a pretty pleasant trip we even stopped for an espresso mm -hmm. So we're at the Albanian border with Macedonia now waiting in line. We're gonna go through passport control. So far, pretty smooth. I'll do a little clip after to let you know how it went. A um, little bit of traffic, but it was pretty quick getting here actually, uh, surprisingly fast. So we are 
officially in North Macedonia. The border crossing was a piece of cake. Um, you know, no PCR test. Uh, there wasn't any special requirements. Um, American citizens, we get 90 days on arrival. And I was talking to my contact in Macedonia and he was saying that it's very easy for us to extend it. So we are officially in North Macedonia now. We're headed into Struga. Uh, it looks like the border crossing is kind of at the very top of the mountain. It was pretty laid back. First you go through the Albania side and then you go through the Macedonia side. Um, they just took a look in the trunk, saw the hiking pack and were like, you know, no problem, move along. Whole process, maybe 15 minutes. Um, and a lot of that was due to traffic. Uh, the actual border crossing itself was pretty easy. Yeah, it was a pretty dope crossing, like top of the mountain pretty awesome yeah very beautiful <laughs> very beautiful we got our we got our handsome driver with us you know really nice showing views. us showing us how to get around so uh we're doing pretty good guys i'm overall very happy it was a uh, smooth trip uh, i don't even think it took us a couple hours to be here including a stop for coffee on the way so uh yeah if you're thinking about crossing from albania into north macedonia it's pretty seamless no pcr test required everything's pretty smooth there was a pretty bad accident um coming across the border so drive carefully it started raining a little bit so the road's pretty slick these roads are really windy guys when they say mountain roads they're not kidding uh the condition of the roads is actually not that bad i don't think it's any different than what you would see in a lot of the states to be honest um i, th I think the problem is they're very windy and then people take them at high speeds so just be really careful but uh yeah guys anyways it was uh good crossing the border easy peasy um, we're going to go check into the apartment and then we'll do some content for Struga. So we're going to show you guys our first impressions of Struga, what we think of the town. Um, so far, uh, good trip. I really can't complain. What's up guys? We have made it to Struga, North Macedonia. The ride took a little bit under three hours. We even stopped for a coffee and that includes traffic at the border. The border crossing was very straightforward. And now we're gonna go check out Struga. I'm excited, looks like a really nice town. What do you think of when you think of Albania? I think of opportunity. I think of a country that's open. I think of a country that wants long stay expats, that wants people to come and invest, wants new ideas, and is looking towards the West. I think that Albania is a beautiful country with incredible landscapes that can offer a very comfortable lifestyle at a very reasonable price. We at the White Monkey Syndicate will help navigate your journey to becoming an expat in Albania. We're working with some of the top lawyers in the city. We can help establish businesses. We can help you get your residency. We can help you get real estate. We can arrange almost any contact that you might need for the process of moving here in almost any city in the country. We will simplify the process. We'll make it a lot easier for you to move to a country that maybe in the past would have been more of a challenge. With our help, it's gonna be a walk in the park.